<laughs> hey guys, what's up? Welcome to your new weekly news roundup with me, Josh Jenner. So I've been gone for a while, guys. My Wi-Fi has just been down and stuff has happened. But I'm going to do a quick weekly roundup. I haven't like posted a video, so I'm just going to do a weekly roundup. Uh, so let's start off with Ryan Reynolds confirming his role as Deadpool, uh, which we all knew was basically going to happen. We pretty much knew. Uh, basically, he posted this image on his Twitter page, uh, announcing that of course he's going to be playing Deadpool and uh, the filming begins in March so really excited for the Deadpool movie guys um, I just honestly I can't wait it's 2016 let's do this and then um, another casting this week is uh, also from a Marvel property we got Doctor Strange and of course Benedict Cumberbatch has confirmed 100% confirmed his role uh, I'm super pumped to see him. I said I love Benedict Cumberbatch in his roles. Um, and I want to talk about Arrow and Flash. Arrow v Flash episode. Was really sick. Loved some of the stuff on that. Uh, really great. I have been catching up with the show. It's really fun. Did love to see so, sort of how they dealt with that. And it was really fun. Um, and now, this is the one I'm most excited about. Is Stanley hinted that Marvel is going to be teaming, maybe teaming up with... Uh, Spider-Man and X-Men, like Avengers. So during Q&A sessions, uh, like basically ce celebrating se the 75 years of Marvel, uh, Stanley said that a, a film crossing the Spider-Man franchise and X-Men and Fantastic Four with the Marvel Universe is something that Marvel is very concerned about. Uh, it's something that they're concerned about, and it is very difficult to bring them all together because the character is so successful and makes so much money that the students don't want to have the rights to let them go. So that's something all the lawyers and all the production companies have to work out. Will they get it worked out? I don't know. So that's basically what he said. And, um, yeah, it's pretty, pretty... Yeah. <laughs> and, um, also, uh, Batman vs. Human Dawn of Justice is wrapped filming. Uh... So, that's going to get into the whole editing process for a whole entire year now, and, yeah. <laughs> we got a Terminator Genesis trailer, that looks epic, CGI looks terrible, but, yeah, I'm not really a big Terminator fan. Um, yeah, <laughs> and um, also, uh, Avengers 2 is going to be doing some reshoots in January of next year, which I am excited for because we get to see more set stuff and you know he wants jo Josh uh, Whedon it's his last film rumoured because he's not apparently not going to be directing Avengers 3 which he should do but apparently he might not so uh, he's trying to make this last one as awesome as he can if they ever do make an Avengers 4 which I doubt they will um, he may t return to direct but he says it's very challenging I don't know why he's giving up honestly um, I expect they're going to do some reshoots because, you know, they want to make the Quicksilver scene more epic than, uh, you know, the one in X-Men Apocalypse, not Apocalypse, uh, Days of Future Past. I am excited for Apocalypse. Speaking of Apocalypse, we also got another casting theme. We got Oscar Isaac confirmed. There's been so much news, like, so much, so much news recently, guys. It's actually hard to understand. I've got, like, 15 tabs as of recording this, I've got like 15 tabs open, just trying to work out like what happened, um, so there's, that's basically most of it, I don't think I missed anything, I'm just double checking, um, we also did get some 007 news, I just remembered that, we got some 007 news and uh, it's gonna be called Spectre, we got some um, Dave Bautista and Confirmage and some other stuff, and you can I'll, I'll make a video of that if you want, guys. And how could I forget the Suicide Squad? The Suicide Squad was confirmed. Uh, the cast was confirmed, so that's pretty sick. Um, I am really excited for this film. It's it's actually a pretty solid cast. Um, I can't even remember who they are. So it was. Okay, let me just go through my ones in favour. So Margot Robbie is going to be playing Harley Quinn. Perfect. Perfect on every level. Yeah. I'll explain that in another video. I'll definitely make a new one. Um, then we've got Will Smith as uh, Deadshot. 
Yeah, yeah, it was mean. Tom Hardy as the Rick Flag guy. And uh Jai Courtney as the other guy. And Cara Delv Delving the Modders the other person. I can't remember it's like Ventress or something. Um Yeah. And then the one that I'm sort of excited for is Jared Leto as the Joker. Uh, I'm going to show you a clip here. This is from one of these movies that he was in. Oh, Enchantress, that was it. Carol Delevingne is Enchantress and Jai Courtney is Boomerang. Um, I'm going to play you a clip here from Jared Leto um, in, a, in a movie he was in. Just look at this. Okay, now if that doesn't look like the Joker, I don't know what does. That looks pretty sick. So I'm excited for him. He is a really great actor, fantastic actor. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. This is my, my roundup. I will talk to you soon because I'm going to be making more epic videos. Thank you and goodbye.